This film was both a commercial and a critical success, earning four Academy Award nominations, one for its screenplay, one for the song Linda, the third for its overall musical score, and number four went to Robert Mitchum, nominated as the Best Supporting Actor for his performance. This was indeed the breakthrough role for Bob Mitchum, after two years of kicking around various studios doing, for the most part, small roles in some 25 films. But he was never less than a star after the story of G.I. Joe. By the way, in 2002, the Hasbro Toy Company released a G.I. Joe action figure made in the likeness of Ernie Pyle. Pyle made it very clear he never considered himself any kind of a hero, but the remarkable way he had of telling stories of G.I.'s in World War II certainly made him a hero to millions. Up next, our 31 Days of Oscar Marathon continues with Gene Tierney, Dana Andrews, and Clifton Webb in one of the all-time great movie mysteries. Tonight on TCM's 31 Days of Oscar, Dana Andrews investigates the portrait of mystery surrounding Laura. Then Joan Crawford makes waves at Warner Brothers as Mildred Pierce, and Judy Garland becomes one of the Harvey girls. You're